the KX News Storm Team. Hey Tom, how's the weather? Yeah, those are some of the members of some of the motorcycle clubs around western North Dakota that last Saturday got together and uh, made sure that over a thousand kids had a really fun Saturday and uh, lots of candy, too. So I want to thank all of them for doing that uh, uh, last Saturday. And uh, let's go ahead and take a look at the weather headlines. Five to ten degrees warmer tomorrow than today. That'll be nice. It'll still be kind of blustery, though. Uh, rain possible Saturday. It'll be a little bit warmer than even Friday. We should have some temperatures in the 50s on Saturday. And that would actually be back up above normal, just not like the past few days. A big drop in temperatures on Sunday, snow likely early next week. In Minot, 34 degrees, winds out of the west northwest at 23 miles an hour. Bismarck's 35 degrees, and it feels like 24 because of that 21 mile an hour wind. Across western North Dakota, oh, already down into the 20s, Crosby at 28 degrees. That is just all of a sudden after yesterday, just a slap in the face. Look at this. We've still got that northwest wind blowing. Most of the temperatures are around freezing or just a few degrees above, and it is pretty blustery. So the wind chills right now are mainly in the low 20s, uh, a little bit colder than that in uh, Crosby. But still, a very, very breezy day. Now, the new drop monitor came out, and I have to tell you, I don't understand why there wasn't an improvement. Remember a couple of weeks ago, Williston had like six inches of snow, and a lot of places had one to two inches of rain. And then that Thursday, when it came out, nothing changed. I just don't get it. And this week, I kind of understand that it, it got worse than last week because we didn't get any precipitation, but it never changed after all that snow and that rain. And this uh, severe drought, this area right in here, has expanded greatly. Again, I don't get it, and I know it's more than just did rain fall or not. There's a lot of things that go into it, but this one actually surprises me a little bit. Here's our precision cast. It's 7 o'clock tonight. Very light rain if it's reaching the ground, but the sky will be clearing out tonight, and the temperatures are going to fall and fall fairly quickly. And then by tomorrow uh, evening, it looks like that southerly flow during the day is going to allow us to warm up tomorrow. Five degrees to 10 degrees uh, warmer than today. Saturday will be warm Warmer than Friday, but on Saturday we could get some rain, maybe some snow. This looks like kind of a mess. This is, nothing here is going to be heavy. Uh, there, if there is any freezing rain, depending on the time of day, like it was really early, uh, it would be brief. But overall, this is just going to be kind of a passing little system here. And then our next decent chance of snow is going to arrive on uh, Monday. So the next 72 hours for Dickinson, uh, 40s, 50s, and then the temperature starts falling back again on Sunday, and kind of pick up a theme here, being windy over the weekend, at least in Dickinson. And then for uh, Williston, I think Williston actually has a pretty good chance of getting some rain on uh, Saturday and back into the mid-50s. So tonight, teens to around 20. Yeah, it's cold night tonight. And then tomorrow, back into the mid-40s for most locations. Here's a look at the Bismarck seven-day outlook. And uh, temperatures will rebound a little bit. And then next week, uh, they go back below normal. Uh, good chance of snow on, um, on Monday there, uh, Joel. Pretty much everywhere in western North Dakota is going to have that chance. It does not appear to be a huge, huge deal for most of us, but it does look like it could be some measurable snow. So, uh, you know, if you, I, I, yesterday we were talking about, uh, you know, making sure you had gas in the snowblower and things like that. I, right now, I'm, I'm kind of thinking, Joel, that the heavier snow may be in the west and probably even more in the northwest. So, like, if, if you're not there, it may not snow a whole lot. You just never know where you're going to get it, but uh, no way to go back to those 70s we just saw a couple days ago here, even though we'd like that. <laughs> Boy, not this week. That isn't going to happen this week at all. <laughs> <laughs> so we kind of know what we're getting here. Things are getting chilly and windy, so this yep. feels a little more like North Dakota. <laughs> yeah, you're right. Thanks so much, Tom. Still to come on KX News.